In Bali, the new year is celebrated in a completely different way than anywhere else in the world. For about one week, the regular Balinese routine life is set aside to give place to various ceremonies. It all start off with Malasti. Treasure from the temple are carried out to the sea to be purified with water. My name is Imade Sukerta. I am living in Banjar Pengembungan. After getting all the offering in the sea for the purification, we are bringing back to the village temple. The next ceremony is pengerupukan, which demands weeks of preparation. Ogohogo, which are huge ugly monsters, are crafted out of polystyrene and wood by the younger generation to scare the evil spirit. The make of the figures are very strong. Strong character can be very ugly, right? Because those kind of things are symbol for the evil spirit. That day in the Pengurupokan in the evening or New Year Eve, those things are carried out by the people or young generation to all the village area and we are scared out all the evil spirit from our life. Starting from 6 a.m., there is a 24 hours mandatory period of silence. No one on the entire island leaves their house. Every shop, restaurant, tourist activity, and even the airport is closed to all locals and even the foreigners here on holiday. This day is called Nyepi. People are visiting their family, friends, and neighbors and enjoying the first day of the year, full of hope for a better future.